you'll never remember something extremely embarrassing and just feel horrible about it. Pro tip. Try to think of something embarrassing some else has done. You probably can't. Which means no one else remembers the cringe thing you did. Wait, that actually helps so much. Starting to dislike slash realize the flaws in Harry Potter feels like waking up from the trance of a fairy king. The smile slowly fades from your face as you step out of the circle of mushrooms, asking yourself, did Joan really win awards for this level of writing? The glassy look begins to vanish from your eyes as you think, why did Cho Chan get constantly berated by the narration? For grieving her graphically murdered dead boyfriend, you remove your flower crown and hold it in shaking hands as you ask yourself, were we all just fine and dandy when JKR decided that one of the four houses at her wizarding school was founded by a Fox white supremacist and was also full of 11 year olds who were forcibly designated as white supremacists? The sky grows darker. You remember the token plagiarism. You remember the house elves. You remember the banker goblins. You begin to run. None of you'll know what propaganda actually is, do you? It's when a British person takes a good look at something. This is legitimately the absolute funniest thing anyone has ever added to one of my posts. Thank you for your service. Concept. A horror comedy about a pizza delivery guy who has to deliver several last minute pizzas on the graveyard shift. The gimmick is that each house he visits is in the middle of another horror movie. Like, the first house has a serial killer chasing the guests, the next house is in a zombie outbreak, the next house has a swamp monster, and so on. And all the pizza delivery guy cares about is delivering the pizza. Also, Rami Malek has to play the pizza delivery guy. I've never been naked, and if you have you're disgusting. I'm imagining this person as a baby, just coming out of the womb in a tiny tailored suit. Texting a boy. Our daughter is texting a boy. I hate family vloggers so much. Imagine having this little respect for your adolescent kids privacy and personal life. Freeloaders don't deserve privacy. Do you know what children are? Did you know some people stop being tired? Like, they enjoy a cup of coffee and then go on with their day, feeling awake and functional? They don't feel exhausted all day long? Like, that's so weird. What's up with that? Source. I overheard these two guys in the hallway at my school, and one of them was like, you always look hot dude, no homo though, and then like 5 seconds later, he yelled, psych, and slapped the other dude's ass. This post is here to remind everybody that gratrunker is the Swedish word for crying while masturbating. That's a real tear jerker. Did you just? To view the grimace gallery, click here. McDonald's cringe camp. Why does it look like this came from a funeral page? The joker be like, ha <laughs> I cream peed you, bad man. Wait, love wins. Frequently bought together. By all three. $20.13. A picture that's worth a thousand words. Making a meat berry. A grape made of meat. Tissue resolularization. Meat berry meat berry meat bee. They did tissue resolularization on a grape. I'm so lucky to have a butler and also an anti-butler who undoes all the tasks that my butler does for me. We can't all be so fortunate. My anti-butler is just me. You've heard of Elf on the Shelf. Now get ready for... Roman Emperor in a lower temperature. Caesar in the freezer. Ruler in the cooler. Julius in the coolius. To everyone who is losing things like concerts and senior proms and commencements and branches they'd had planned forever and literally anything they've been looking forward to I'm sorry. I really am. It sucks and I'm sure there will be people in your life who will tell you to get over it because others have it worse right now and while it may be true that others have it worse that doesn't make your pain, disappointment or sadness any less real or valid. Keep your head up. My sister's wedding was just cancelled by the venue when I told one of my friends how upset she was and how heartbroken we all were to have worked and planned so much. She just said, well, it's good. 
I understand that there is illness and people at risk, but the callousness of it shocked me, just as she was unmoved by my other sister being sent home her senior year, losing her research job, putting all the cells in the freezer, 3 years of work, her thesis, graduation, oh, everyone is doing that, your loss is valid. God and even if you are hearing about someone's inconsequential thing they loved, a concert, a brunch, you don't know if that's the thing they've been sticking around for or not. So just like f***ing chill and be kind. It hurts for everyone, in different ways, you aren't being selfish for losing something you loved. The Bart Room. An object from my dream last night. It was just the microwave I have in real life that someone sharpied a Bart in. It wasn't big, like large enough to fit a person or even be considered a room, yet everyone in my dream, myself included, referred to it as a Bart room. What does this mean? Enter the Bart room. The first rule of writing is hoard notebooks. The second rule of writing is we do not write in our notebook hoard. Apocalypse. 2021. The dyslexic man who wrote 2012. If you press the clitoris and the G spot at the same time, the vagina takes a screenshot. Hey, what? We've discovered how this image was taken. Me, as my laptop fan suddenly becomes louder. What is it? What program? Who is doing this to you? Imagine a side character in a show or movie who can hear the soundtrack as a superpower. Like, music suddenly changes to dark suspense. Side character. Ah, sh, we are about to get attacked. Other characters, visibly confused. The F, or, main character theme starts playing. Side character. Oh, let's go ask that guy for help. He's got his own song, so like, he's gotta know what he's doing. Fooling around with my colleague on the Death Star. Imperial March starts playing. Oh, sh, you get it. What I see, versus what the cat sees, before I pet it. Hash, they associate this stance with love. Why don't murderers just hide the bodies in cemeteries? Thanks for the tip. No, this is not a tip, this is a joke. Eggplants really are just grapes, but purpier, larger, and different. So they're not eggplants. That's what I'm getting at, yeah. What the f? People actually tell their crushes they like them. What the hell do you do? I die. Lmao. What kind of question? When life gives you lemons, combine their DNA with a prehistoric mosquito that was preserved in amber and create the Tyrannosaurus Rex. It's been a while since Dennis got me to say, what the fresh f? Why did they make us stack cups in elementary school? I had completely forgotten about this, but was it just my school that was off the fucking walls about it? They would show us videos in gym of professional cup stacking and yell, this could be you. We spent every Tuesday in gym with those goddamn cups and we all had, like, the cup stacking catalog. I made my parents buy me glow in the dark cups for my 9th birthday. What are we as a society? We had that too. Like. They were trying to convince some of us to get good enough to go to contests for it and sell us cups. So many cups. Cups to appease every type of child. Not even cups you can drink from. I'm not American. Is this real or is this a convoluted sh post? The Antichrist came and went, but no one noticed because he wasn't worse than the current state of the world already is. The rapture followed, but no one went to heaven. So we didn't notice that either. We've been living in hell for the last 5 years, and no one has noticed, yet. Oh, I didn't realize this was a writing prompt. Is there anything quite like inviting all your friends over to your New Horizons island, and watching them line up to your bulletin board, like it's the single available outhouse at a music festival, to take turns drawing another pp on it? To caterpillars are escaping a spider. They climb up a branch and get to the edge, but realize they are now trapped. Hold on tight, says the first caterpillar, and he quickly chews through the branch. 
It snaps, and they begin to fall, but he grabs two protruding twigs, and uses them to steer the branch through the air with grace and finesse. That's amazing, says the second caterpillar. How in the hell are you doing that? The first caterpillar scoffs. Am I the only one in the whole damn forest who knows how to drive a stick? One time I was complaining about my shitty parents to a friend, and he got frustrated and said, I'm gonna be your dad now, and your mom. Your dumb. Wait, shh, no. Once I had stopped laughing, I said, daddy, and he swerved the car and lectured me on never saying that again. Imagine your OTP. Normal ocean creatures. Ah. Vival RC. The blue, it is harsh, but it is my love. I'm a magnificent creature in a magical place. The deep ocean weirdos. I don't need oxygen to survive. I haven't eaten since the fall of Byzantium. I have 300 eyes on my eyeballs. It's been 14,000 years since I've bumped into another life form. I'll kick anything's ass. Nothing can kill me, not even death. Emmanuel Missionary Baptist Church. Remember, Satan was the first to demand equal rights. I hate living in Texas. Can't tell if this is anti-equal rights or pro-Satan. We're the Care Bears. And we care about you. Who asked you to? Savage. Menstrual pads have been mentioned in history as early as the 10th century in ancient Greece, where a woman is said to have thrown one of her used menstrual rags at an admirer in an attempt to get rid of him. What a f***ing power move. Popular opinion. Mint ice cream and other mint flavored foods taste great and you all can't change my mind. OP. Do you accept constructive criticism? Choose your next words carefully. Dear Sushi. Mint suck. You come into my house. Disrespect my mints. Does anyone know what day it is today? Like June number 75th I think. March 33rd. It's freaking April. Bullsh. It's fucking Christmas you morons. It's the 88th day of Christmas. The defibrillator toaster. My mom would be so annoyed. Every morning I would run into the kitchen screaming. We are losing them. Beep 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 beep. Don't you die on me. Damn it. Nurse. We need 12 cc's of cream cheese. Stat. He's bread. Jim. Time of deliciousness. 7.15 a.m. If we don't rest out his heart. He's toast. Jesus Christ. Jam it. Dad is in a butter place now. Kids. My cat meatballs in a sweater started kinda coming off. So my girlfriend went to fix it, and as she did, so she said to him, in her most tender and maternal voice, or, is your shirt coming off? Prostitute. The first five words of this post alone contained so much storytelling. Can they please make a dishwasher with a transparent door? I want to see what's going on in there. Washing machine. Open. Honest, shows you how it's cleaning your clothes. Dishwasher. Mysterious, untrustworthy, keeps its cleaning methods a secret. Me. Drunk as F at a party. Friend. Bro. Why are you crying? Me. Do you think Tumblr misses me bro? You're telling me there are people who listen to music and don't use it as the soundtrack for the intense cinematic daydream plot they've always got playing in the back of their head. Mm -hmm.